what is real life? That, was. that wasn't my provider, that was my hub just died. Like, really hard, just death. Death forever. Yeah, it died so hard. Like, you know the little connection indicator on the bottom right? Instead of having an exclamation mark, it just had an X. It was like, no, your internet doesn't exist. <laughs> so... I guess, I guess so. <laughs> Thank you for your patience, friends. I'll finish this one. Off. Naturally. Okay. Did you miss me? I missed you guys. I thought it was gonna be alone forever. It's really bad actually. The place that I live is a super dead zone for 4G. I have no idea why. Um, so I had like absolutely no way of telling you guys that I had no connection for a good amount of time there until I sort of like wandered around the house until it connected and I could tweet. <laughs> Yeah, it's really weird. It's actually, it's so bad that it messes my phone up, and if I try and make a call while connected to 4G, it just doesn't go through. It just fails. I have to go to 3G. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty annoying. The thing is, it's one of those things that you don't know until you move in and start trying to use it, you know? It wasn't one of the things that I could check before I moved in. Oh, I could be boned. I had to kill him real quick. The fight continues. My lessons are complete. Oh, that's sexy. Hit 20? Nice. Over already? Kinda wanna go running over there. He looks pretty squishy. I think we could beat him up. Oh, that's an archer. I've made a boo-boo! Oh no! Okay. Get my healer ready. This is a paralogue for a character I stole from another house. So technically yes, but also no. The guy with the hair. Yes, it's his name. Oh dear. 38. Dodge! Too slow. Thank you. So obvious. Speed, dude. Why would you do that? That was tough. <laughs> Rip. Yep, I got Caspar. And hopefully I'll get Bernadetta and Raphael soon if they stop being jerks. And I think Hilda too. We back, yeah. It all comes down to this. Hey, don't bully don't bully Cyril. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. <laughs> uh, my hub just died, and I don't know why. I had to restart it and then wait. Don't underestimate me. What's next? Magic. It took an age, but we're almost there. Hmm. I'm doing exactly what he just did to me. I don't know if I want to do that. Hey, Flink, go get that. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? She dies, right? Whatever. Oh dear. It's too bush. I should have healed him. <laughs> Tyson, dear cutlets, thank you for the resub. Thank you for the 11 months of support and welcome back to the Lime Cult. Thank you very, very much for supporting the channel. Thank you, thank you. I'll help too. This is our chance. Why did you go so close? Oh, whatever. I like how Dorothy is visible there too. I had no choice. That might actually help him survive. You're outclassed. I'm not hurt too bad. That's what you get. It's going okay. We're all doing fine. Casper yeah. <laughs> seems to do quite jump. a bit of damage. You're out of luck. Danger removed. If you hit. Good job, Ash. The fight continues. Ooh, have you found something nice? Go ahead and hand it over. <gasps> a thing! Get a thing! Get that thing! No. Thieves, do not allow them to escape. His ferrets are cute. You didn't give it your all. Okay. Let us be cautious. Cautious, really? You wimp. Hmm. Oh, 
appreciate it. Yeah, this one is just survive until the end. I think I can also kill the boss if I want to. I stand ready. Get him! Oh, that best not poison me. I do live. Hello. Guess I'm pretty strong. Just the poopy hub died horribly in a fire. saw this mission someone cheesed it with warp or something it was kind of funny oh that's a bit scary for Lawrence oh god Not let them through. Oh, I didn't see what he dropped. Or did he just run past me? He might have just run past me. Yes, he did. What a weenie. Yeah. What's done is done. A devil sword. Hooray! Strength, nice, nice. Wait, where'd that guy go? Oh my god, he's a million years away. Come back. Come back, you shit. Ah, crap. Maybe I can snipe him out. I have to be a dead eye. Oh, that's not high. Come on, you can do it! Nice. Oh, that's not good. What's he using? What's he carrying? No idea. I really like punching. I think I'm gonna be able to get this guy. And that sucks. And I should be fine. Hopefully. Actually, no, he might not be because his weapon's now broken, so he's gonna lose all of that. That's cool. <laughs> Please don't hit me. Ow. She might be in trouble. Oh, 
Or Flame might be in trouble. Everyone's in trouble. Yeah, you beat him up with your broken bow. Don't bully Flane! Oh god, she's dead! I must. That's okay. Bye, Flame. I'll do my best. Seems I prevailed. We're in trouble. Actually, no, we're not. We can get that. What a jump. I'm not specifically avoiding purple nodes, but I'm also not prioritizing them. I'm mostly prioritizing trying not to die. That one is expected. Doing my part. I really would have liked to kill this boss. Never mind. Nice. I had no choice. You're really going for it. I don't think I can physic her. No, she's just out of range. Oh, that's super frustrating. Ready when you are. I can't kill the mustache, but I wanna. You yeah, know, she might dodge to victory. With me. Oh, ye of little faith. <laughs> Yeah, I, have, I believe in her. She's gonna dodge to victory. We just watch this. Dodge! Never mind! <laughs> Alright, not that time, but this time she's gonna dodge her way to victory. 37% Ingrid! Magic, please stop. Hello. Ow. Ow. <laughs> that looked really. My people need me. <laughs> that looks super janky. Each battle. Chance to grow. Let's be careful. All right, punch him to death. I'll send you flying. Yeah. You see that? Or kick him, I guess. That works too. I think I can take dead eye punch shots at this guy from here. Oh, I can't. That's sad. I mean, in fairness, I'm kind of being Not a bit so silly fast. with this map. I think if I turtled, it would be fairly easy, but... Ooh. Neato burrito.
I love this part of Misada's. If she heals him, she heals herself. Boop. Easy. Oh, he's going! Coming for me. scary. I don't really want that right now. Bibi bop him. Okay. And then hide in here. <laughs> Actually, that's not fair. Hide. No. Hide here. You hide here. You hide here. That helps. Rally that child. Okay, they should be fine to hold that one. Oh, well, uh, thanks. And then you defend that. Now. <laughs> Ow. Ooh, damn, dude. That was a good gambit. Question, does Mercedes rescue thing fix that status debuff? Or whatever it is, fortify? If you could just not get in my way. One, two, three. Easy. Uh, wait, I lose. I give up. I surrender. Please don't kill me. <laughs> You have my thanks, Professor. Please go on ahead. I will clean up here and then report to my father. See you back at the monastery. Whee! We did it! I'm getting a lot of battalions. I should really pay more attention to that. Your assistance in this incident with Acheron has proved most essential. Consider me in your debt. Thanks to you, the Alliance was able to nip this internal conflict in the bud. What will become of Acheron? He has written a pledge to my father, swearing never to cause trouble about the border again. Of course, he is hardly the type to bind himself in good faith to anything written on paper. But Acheron has many connections, both in the Alliance and in the Empire. To remove him entirely would cause more conflict. We will just have to watch him closely for now. That is a prudent decision. Indeed. I do plan to eliminate him eventually, however. <laughs> he is nothing but trouble. Incidentally, there was one other benefit to embarking upon this errand. Have a look at this. The Magic Staff Thursus, a relic passed down through House Gloucester for generations. 
It seems my father has finally recognized my ability. Apparently, he had been considering entrusting this relic to me for some time. He has had precious few opportunities to take to the field of battle personally of late. Doubtless, by giving this to me, he intends to send the message that I must work even harder. I will certainly continue to do my utmost, but I am by no means completely subservient to his will. Uh, you disagree with your father's opinions? I would not go so far as that, but my father seldom thinks beyond the immediate benefit of our house. While that is important, I prefer to consider the greater good when I make decisions. I believe that is a noble's duty. Now, for the time being, may I trust you to decide how we may best make use of Thursus? For the moment, I think you are in the best position to apply it to the betterment of all Fodlan. To be quite honest, I am not certain I feel ready to decide the fate of a relic on my own just yet. Do me this favor, Professor, and I will be grateful. Now to celebrate! Allow me to treat you to tea. Is that a staff? Again? Nice. Okie dokie. I'm not sure if anyone has any motivation. Okay, no, there's, if there's a few. We're okay. Felix! Yay! He loves it! A new power that I can use. Nice. What? It was nothing. Of course I... Okay, and then Ash. Ash doesn't really need it anymore. I've left. Give him some authority, I guess. Felix doesn't want to join so you? Oh no. Done. Did you get him to B? This will... Uh, I don't know what else to train him in, really. I guess authority. Thanks. Oh, he probably didn't have a battalion equipped. That was dumb. Florence is naturally a bad unit, interestingly enough. I'm begin like he did okay. Oh, I should probably get him some writing skill though. Good lord. Hi, Tor. How are you? That was. I That was. Nice. I'm certain. I'm actually gonna force magic on her. Or faith, sorry. Your knee is busted? Uh, it's hard. I'm sorry. 
Professor. Uh, no. You must punch things. Sedeth would like to speak with me? Sure. Wait, Sedeth isn't ah, a student of mine, are. is he? No, he's not. I apologize for calling you in so suddenly. What do you want? Please, sit. There is a matter I would like to discuss with you. I believe I've told you this before, but it is my responsibility to aid the Archbishop in all her duties. What are these duties? Spiritual instruction, ceremony oversight, donation management, all of the Church's many administrative tasks. I oversee not only the priesthood, but also the Knights of Seros and the Officers' Academy. The Archbishop entrusts a great deal to my discretion, and I am honored by her confidence. Even when she must make decisions herself, she often seeks my counsel in advance. And yet... Your appointment to a teaching position at the Officers Academy was a complete surprise to me. Not only that, but you have also been entrusted with the Sword of the Creator. I was as surprised as anyone else to learn that. Frankly, I am just not sure how to handle you. I am the Archbishop's right hand, and yet when it comes to you, I have been told almost nothing. You don't trust me. Not quite. I do find you to be a trustworthy individual, but my subjective opinion is not enough. I mean, I did I help you with to your cautious. totally Should not the daughter's thing. Should trust in you prove to be misplaced, it is the faithful who will suffer most. First, I would like to know just how much you know about yourself. You are the child of Gerald Eisner, correct? I think so. That's quite a vague reply for such a basic question. In the future, I would advise you to answer such queries with confidence. As the former captain of the Knights of Seros, Geralt is renowned throughout Fodlan. If you really are his child, then no one would voice any complaint about you joining the Knights. How long has it been since you became a mercenary? Uh, I'm not sure about that either. I see. Most curious. The game gave me no backstory. Help me! Your age. Just how God old damn are it! You exactly. Uh. Your face says it all. You truly don't know, do you? Just what was Gerald thinking, raising you this way? Given your responses thus far, I feel as though any further questions would just be a waste of our time. However, permit me to make one thing clear. Whatever her reasons, the Archbishop has placed great faith in you. Do not betray that trust. That is all. Yay, support conversation. Game, I just want to save, please. Ahem. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh no, it's time for an event. Apologies I'm never allowed to stop. Wait. Thank you for gathering here on the eve of the highly anticipated ball to bear witness to the Academy-wide dance competition. Woo. Welcome to the White Heron Cup. Ooh. The competition will be judged by you, me, again. your humble servant, Alois Ronga. <laughs> and also... Dorbat, thank you for the resub! Thank you for the 56 months of support and welcome back to the live cult. Thank you very, very much for supporting the channel. Thank you, thank you! That's an incredibly long time. You ahead of me now? The acclaimed former songstress of the Mitchell Frank Opera Company, Manuela Casagranda! Yes, yes, thank you! Oh, and it should go without saying, but... I swear to show no bias <laughs> to my own house. Got it? Good. Last but not least, the glamorous assassin who does all of her dancing in the dead of night, Shamir Navran! Hmm. The three of us swear on our honor to judge the following proceedings with utmost impartiality and fairness. And with that, Will the representatives of each house please make their way to the stage? Contestants, are you ready to dance? And is the band prepared to play? Very well. B 
begin! Time! Wow. That's all, what folks. wonderful dancing. Splendid! All three of you were fantastic. <laughs> now, no, let's I chose hear Dorothea. what the judges have to say. Oh my, let's see. I suppose I have no choice but to vote for the Blue Lion House. Hey. Keep practicing and you could really shine out there. I vote for Blue Lion House. Hey! The way you carried yourself was striking. Give me that golden buzzer or whatever. Great feedback, both of you. Well then, let's see. Factoring in my own humble opinion, yes, we have a winner. And I will announce who it is right now. Without any delay, the winner of this year's White Heron Cup is... The Blue Lion House! I wonder if I can use this to bolster my singing career. Once more, please give a big round of applause for our talented participants. Yay! Sword dance combat art and the sword... Okay. Good. Well, this sword art's very useful. Yes! Good to see you, Professor. Rare for you to come talk to me. No, you came to talk I'd to love me. It if you could teach me more about training and stuff like that. I know that ain't easy with me stuck in a different class and all. Why don't you put me in your class? Invite. Oh, really? I was only kidding around. But if you're offering, I won't say no. You better not go easy on me. Hell you yeah. gotta toughen me up if I'm gonna become a proper knight. <gasps> Dimitri's birthday! <gasps> We're gonna have a tea party with Dimitri! Happy birthday, Dimitri! Uh... Yeah. I apologize for the wait. I was busy screaming about murdering people again, but it's okay. I've got myself under control. Thank you. Mm. I love how he attends in full gaunt <laughs> and stuff. I also blush when talking about the future of my country. <laughs> this this cakes look really nice. So it is. Indeed. I feel down, I go out for a long ride on my own. There is no place more relaxing than a trusted steed's back. I'd like to go for a long ride with it. Wait. Nod. So it is. Would you like a training I appreciate it. You're welcome. I am not good with facial expressions. <laughs> Is my smile passable at present? <laughs> yeah, dude. The fuck? How warm and comforting. Nice chest. That's... Is that right, Professor? Hmm? How about this? Hmm? <laughs> it's 
thank you for the treat. I had a wonderful time. I would love to do this again, if that is acceptable to you. I love how, of all things, they chose tea time. Like, the vast majority of characters in this seem really awkward during tea time, but they're like, no, this is how you're gonna socialize with your students. Pardon me, Professor. We're all done. I can do better now. Well worth the effort. I appreciate your effort. You're welcome. I think I can promote someone. Mercedes can become a thing. She can become a bishop. Well, oh, that's really pretty. I love it. Nice. I'm so glad I passed. I'm assuming she can't because she's not good enough. Wait, what can she become from here? There's not really an advanced class that works for her. She would need to go axe. The fuck? I guess you... That's kind of weird. Yeah, I guess I'll have to go this for a while and then switch to monster. She's gonna have to learn axe stuff though, which is just weird. And then, then she's gonna have to learn sword for this! Blimey. Oh yeah, Dorothea can become a ma uh, dancer now, right? I assume that's in the reclass menu. I actually want you to become this because the skill is super good. Yeah, <laughs> Congrats! something new, won't I? But what does she look like now? I guess I'll have to wait for a natural thing to see. Support conversations, oh boy. Still can't deepen that bond. I'm not doing this one because I don't want to cut my character out. Your Highness, sorry, I mean, Dimitri, would you, um, do you want to train together today? Ash, of course, I'm glad you asked. After classes conclude for the day, meet me at the training ground. I'll be waiting. And afterward, let's plan on dinner. We'll certainly have worked up an appetite. Oh, this yes, is cute. I suppose, uh, I mean, sure, it'd be, that is, 
Uh, it would be my pleasure to, uh, to dine with you. I mean, I, I uh, um... Ash. I'm sorry, your highness. I'm just no good at this. I'll do my best to improve. Are you still worrying over what I said to you before? I'm trying to do as you asked, but it's just completely against my nature. Trust me, I understand the urge to show respect where it is due. However, that is not the case here. Yes, I was brought up in a different family and raised in a different way, but otherwise, you and I are the same. That all makes sense, your highness. But I just can't bring myself to speak to you in such a casual way. Sure, when you get right down to it, royalty like you and common folk like me, we're all just people. But the common folk still rely on the nobility to keep the peace and to keep them safe. Commoners pay the price for that in taxes and respect. That's what Lenato says. I suppose I can understand that point of view. But the flaw in your logic is that I am not king just yet. But that's not all there is to it. Hmm? I also respect you as a person. You carry the weight of the whole kingdom on your shoulders. You're a faultless warrior, and you're always so kind to your allies. Even me. On all accounts, I can say the same of you. But you also have a strong heart. I can't say that about myself. No matter the circumstance, you are never drawn toward darkness. That mindset of yours has done me well on countless occasions. Well, I... I do my best. So I guess, mutual respect between us is what's really the most appropriate. Precisely. Which means there's never any need to be nervous or uncomfortable around one another. It seems we may have circled back to where we started with this conversation, but let's at least agree that we both should learn to bend a bit. How's that sound? All right. Let's start from the beginning, then. Would you like to train with me today, Your Highness? Of course, Ash. Come at me with everything you've got. <laughs> Come at me, bro. <laughs> Felix? So, uh, it was your turn to clean out the greenhouse, right? Yes. Well, I went ahead and took care of it. I also cleaned up the warehouse. Why? I just wanted to help you out. So that... Okay, fine. I'm bribing you. So you'll forget. Forget what? Are you really gonna make me say it? Before, in the greenhouse, I want you to forget what you saw and heard. If you agree to forget about it, I'll take your shift in the stables. Do we have a deal? No, thanks. No? But that's not okay! You have to forget about it, right this moment! I can't. It's permanently etched in my memory. <laughs> a mountain of sweets, as well as steaks and cakes. Stacks of them, apparently. I'm also intrigued by those bear and swamp beastie songs you mentioned. Ah, and I've been meaning to ask about the move that went along with Crumbs and Youngs. Was that fencing footwork? Oh, stop it, Felix! You're a villain! Hmm? You think you're so funny? For those who don't remember, a she, he caught her singing a really lame song. Well, you have to forget about it! Please! What if I make you a nice steak dinner? You like steak, don't you, Felix? It'll be yummy! This isn't about steak. I just... Fine! Be stubborn! Tell the whole world for all I care! I'll just learn to live with the funny looks I'll get from everyone! They'll all say, There goes that Annette! The girl with the funny ideas about food! You're just the evilest of villains, Felix! I'll hate you forever and ever! Hmm. I was just trying to be nice. Funny ideas about food? Even the bullies in her head are ridiculous. <laughs> I really don't understand that girl.
Okay, Mercy. This time we're gonna be really good and get the supplies with no detours. You're so good at sticking to a plan. I should leave the shopping to you. I'll stay out of your way and just browse. Hey, that's not fair. I want to browse too. Looks like you girls are having a good time. Uh, Annie? Is this a friend of yours? I've never seen this person before. I'm sorry to be rude, but we're kind of busy. Wait a minute. I think you're shopping with money you stole. What? We don't need to worry your pretty little heads. What? I'm just gonna have to take it back for us common folk. Step back, Mercy. This could get dangerous. Listen here, you. There's no way you can win against me. I don't want to fight you, but I will if I have to. So just back away. You think you can talk to me that way? I'm gonna... Oh, the knights are coming. Yeah, this what? is a support conversation. Annie, run! <sighs> this is far enough. We should be safe. I hope so. But what were you thinking? That sort of behavior isn't like you at all. I just... I thought you were in danger, Mercy. You're actually blaming me for this? It's like I don't even know you anymore. The fuck? Mercy! I was just trying to protect you. That doesn't seem like an increase in support at all. It's gonna be some time before we can be friends with or in an earring with him. Hey, Tizito, welcome back. I've gotta finish up there though. I have work in the morning. So sorry about the internet issues partway through that, you guys. Thank you very much for bearing with your all sweet and lovely people. Thank you so much for hanging out tonight. I should be back again uh, tomorrow, actually. Same time, same place with more video games. Thank you very much for hanging out, everyone. Let me see what I can send you guys over to. You. Um... Let's see. Looks like Gaijin Goomba's playing some video games. I'm gonna send you guys over to Gaijin Goomba. Please uh, go and say hi to Gaijin Goomba for me, you guys. He is very, very entertaining and an all-around nice dude. So please go and say hi, drop some limes, loves, and some limes oos in his chat. And I'll catch you guys next time. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye.